1970 Volkswagen Convertible, restoration number two. Clip 23, painting wheel rim, October 2011. Remove all balancing weights on all of the wheel rim. Since I plan to have the tire rebalanced, I did not mark the location or save the weights. Locate the dents or ding on each wheel and use the round object that fit the rim bend, such an old socket and a hammer, and beat the dent out. The dent shown nearly removed. With an electric drill and a wire brush, clean both sides of the wheel rims. Use steel wool and clean both sides of each wheel. After sanding with 120 and 220 sandpaper, use soap and water and clean up the tire and wheel rim. Lay out the wheel rim so that they will dry. Work effort on this section, approximately four hours. Use a wire brush on a drill press and clean up the lug bolts. Wash the lug bolt with paint thinner and hang on the board for drying and painting. Lug bolts are 14 mm by 1.5 by 18 mm long. Use a 19 mm or 3 4 inch socket. Tape up both sides of all five rims as shown. Work effort approximately four hours. Vic Diabin painting the prime sealer on the lug bolt. The sealer is the same as previously used. Note Vic is wearing the lowest approved attire. Vic painting prime sealer on the back side of the rim. Vic painting prime sealer on the front side of the rims. Vic painting the top coat on the front side of the rim. The top coat is a DuPont urethane paint mix 812, the same ratio as the body paint as previously discussed. VW original color is L91 with chrome or silver or gray. The paint store did not have the formula to mix this color so they called DuPont and DuPont supplied an alternate at DuPont C8501, which is a GM number 15 color. Both sides of all five rims have now been painted. The wiper arm would also painted the original factory color. Also, the lug bolts. The finished product. Vic did another outstanding job. Work on this section, six hours. Work on this chapter, 14 hours. Total hour to date, 372. Stay tuned for progress reports.